Hey there ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video of Gaming Lex. This time around I'm going to be showcasing Project Cars. I saw Expander 69 play Project Cars 2 demo on his YouTube channel the other day. And I decided to try Project Cars 1, uh, it seems to work so far. And yeah, so Project Cars, it came out quite a few years ago. I got this a long, long time ago, covered it on my first ever channel. Um, as you can see, there's a, oh, I don't even know if you can see, there is a lot of cars over here. Um, there's a bunch of cars to choose from and so basically, uh, one issue I've found. Oh yeah, I'm also going to be uh, trying my GoPro with this for some reason. So we'll see how this works. Um, I've got it. I may as well try it. Um, but I've been getting this issue here. It says fail to save the data. Do you want to retry to save? You say yes, and it just never ends. Um, and another issue is that I could only get my wheel working in PS3 mode, which doesn't seem to give me the force feedback effects that I want, um, but it recognises the buttons at least, um, which is better than nothing. I'd rather use the wheel without force feedback than use a keyboard or a joypad. Um, and another issue I find is leaving a race, it just loads forever. So let's actually have a look at what car I want to try. Um, McLaren P1. And there's a bunch of tracks as well, so... Let's see what we've got. What we can give a try. Mm. Maybe try Brands Hatch. Yeah, let's go for that. Uh, it's got the error again. Can I get rid of that? Oh my god. Oh, I've got the goddamn car in automatic. Oof. It definitely feels a lot slower now I'm racing against a bunch of cars. Frame rate wise. Oof. On the grass. This game still looks amazing though. I mean, I've got it on like pretty high settings to be fair as well, so. Keep it clean. Yeah, ooh! I haven't used triple screen gaming uh, for a while, so I thought I'd give it a crack. Uh, because it's a bit awkward to do in 1804, I've recently got it working again. But racing games are the absolute best games to actually use triple screen with. I'm going off track. I'm going off track. I can't prevent this. Get back on track! But yeah, it's great because you can just. The amount of vision that you have on the triple screen is, is just awesome on this resolution. Like, especially when you're... Oh, I cannot keep... This. Especially when you're racing side by side. There you go. Check it up the inside. Ooh! Take that sign. I don't know if it's the... Oh, no! No, 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 no! This is fine. I'm probably going to be last, aren't I? Yes. A bit of peace and quiet, that's all I wanted. That's, uh, I feel like that's two. Yes. Let me just see for one and back. That's better. Let's get a bit more comfortable whilst I'm not racing anybody. Oh. Ooh. Not racing anybody, I still can't keep it on track. Ooh. 
still recording, boy? One minute. Yeah, I guess this is, uh, will be one of the problems when people uh, try games with Proton, especially with steering wheels, is that certain wheels will not fully work. So G29 at the moment for me is not properly working. Yes, I win. <laughs> oh. Okay, I wonder if... Because this is the part where it usually breaks on this loading screen. Oh, okay, well that's one way to actually get it back to the moment. Okay, let's actually try a Formula Ray car. This might be difficult. Or should I do Formula B? Let's do B maybe. Yeah, screw it, let's do B. Okay, and then I'll try and find a track that I'm actually familiar with. Uh, like Silverstone or something. Or Nürburgring? No, the Norse Life? Oh, I like Laguna Seca. Uh, let's try Laguna Seca, screw it. Two laps, 19 opponents. Let's actually turn the opponents down. Uh, the number of opponents. Like. Nope. Oh, I should have put it in manual gearing. Whoa, what the? It's like they break at the start. Oh yeah, this feels so weird without force feedback, dude. I see you. Oh my god. Ah! Maybe in a second would be such a good circuit for the F1 cars, but I think the corkscrew just renders it impossible for real car F1 cars to go on this track and race on this track. So I know an F1 car went around this track quite a few years ago now. I think like 2008 or something? And set like the fastest lap in. Ooh, that's the corkscrew. Ah. Keep it on the track. Keep it on the track. Ooh. Skip an exit. Ah, oh, come on. Too good of an exit. Come boyo. Take that, thank you very much. Okay, mate, let's see if we can get him on this lap. Try to force an error. He's under big pressure now. Okay, Come mate. on, you can take him. Yeah, I was already taking him, mate. You're too busy freaking talking. Woof! I really don't want to slam into someone that goes through. Despite the no force feedback, these cars are still pretty damn nice to drive. Oh shit. <laughs> that was a better, better race. Ah, sixth. That wasn't too great, but pretty happy with that. No, fuck you. Let me have one more race. Let's see what, let's see what we can go for here. Uh, actually, might have a look at Norge Life. 
incoming disaster. Traction and the last. Ah! Holy cow! Ah, it's so hard to judge without the freaking force feedback on this car. The Formula B was so easy to drive. to a puppy. Ooh. It's hard doing stuff like keeping the car in a straight line without full feedback. I'm not sure if you can tell. Sorry mate! That's how you overtake in an F1 car. <laughs> Holy shit. Ooh, get some speed! Oh shit! Sorry. Sorry. Oh, he's got his DRS open, I need to... No, I don't even care, I can still get him. his fault. <laughs> I don't know if I have damage on, I hope not. Oh, well, my car's still turning, so I'll take it as a no. Ooh. Oh, for crying out loud. This track is so narrow, man. It's so hard to... Oh. Hey, that's how you do a clean overtake, apparently. Wait for the wider areas of the track. Oh! Carl's just bought him out on me. Oh, he's overtaken me. It's fine, not last. All fine. Can I pause again? Oh, there you go. Just checking, that's 40 seconds. I guess I can just... I mean, that doesn't count. I was already crashing. Oh, the curves are so high! Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, hello?
come on. Oh, <laughs> Oh my freaking god. Are you serious? Thank God the damage is off. Okay, we're not gonna get anywhere with this. I don't think. Can this guy switch stream? Closing. I'll take that, thank you. Oh. <laughs> what the f Yeah, you Wait, I think that... Oh, there might be two laps on. I'm not doing two laps. There is two laps on. I'm not doing two laps. Well. Oh, there's a sea change camera. Let's not do that. I'm just trying all the buttons. Ooh. Ooh. This is the final lap of the race. See if you can take that guy in front of you, otherwise just bring it back in one piece. What guy? Oh I can't imagine racing like that. In triple screen. This is fine. Bang! Oh, well damage is on, but. I guess it doesn't affect the actual car. I think mean, this is this one. Oh yes, yeah, so this is like helmet cam. So it like looks at the um, looks at the corners. It's really weird. It makes the steering wheel uh, blurry, I guess. Oh shit! Okay. Uh, I think my work here is done. But yeah, uh, that's Project Cars. Let's see if I can actually exit. Let's uh, actually just simulate. Up, woman. Yes, I did very good. Okay, I think this is the time that it's actually screwing up and loading. Uh, this is why I've got it in Windows mode because when, when I had it in full screen, I just couldn't quit the game or anything. Um, but yeah, I mean, it runs okay. Um, if you want to start a career mode, I uh, wouldn't recommend. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, it's. Yeah, see, I can't do anything with it, so all I have to do is goodbye. But yeah, that's Project Cars game was released, I think, way back in like 2014, I want to say. 2015. Uh, I mean, Project Cars 2 is out. The demo is, you can download that now and try it out as well. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Rate and subscribe for future links content. And peace and hello. See you later.